hello friends we are starting our the next tutorial it's the fifth tutorial in this tutorial we will learn how to change the color of our page for example uh, by default my web page is a white color and the my text is uh, black let's suppose if i want to change my color let's suppose uh, i want to change my color to uh, of white or anything else or black or something else so uh, what we do we, we use some colors here for example we are using the bg color tag bg means background color text the bg color text always run on the body or in the specific table so body here i use the bg color is equals to here I write the number of colors I have for example I use let's suppose red mm -hmm. so let's see what will happen if I write the red mm. here is my page I see tutorial 3 open with okay now let's see the my page color will be changed to red same as if I want to change uh, for example off white so color will be different it should be the pinkish it means it cannot support the off white so light green it should be it is the light green so same as what the color we want we can make uh, other than the light colors uh, we have the another option we can use the numbers for example we know that the color of light is three that is red green and blue so the first two numbers belongs to uh, the red and starting from zero to f it's the mean the 15 uh, 16 digit code so let's suppose if I use for example red should be full ff green should be full and uh, blue should be 88 should be lighter let's see what's happening here you see there the deficiency of the blue color here see this is the yellowish form so if I increase the number the color should be more lighter uh, because according to the light uh, if, if the light is on uh, if the all colors are uh, on the color should be the white and if the all colors off it will become the black color see color is going to be lighter same if i use let's suppose ff it will become the all white see the color is uh, changed same as if i use the uh, less colors or if I use the zero zero so my all colors will become black let's see gone text is here see but it doesn't shows why because my text is going to be black so So here is my required color. 
so I can make change the different of the color it can be the 256 multiply by 256 multiply by 256 colors we can change now uh, the second thing is you see uh, if I uh, my text is not justified for example if I am uh, making to be the lesser my text will going to be in not justified form so uh, same as uh, we have three types of the tags in the paragraph we can uh, make to be the align let's suppose if I write align is equals to right by default it is left so if I align its right it will become right from the left side is alignment and the uh, right side it is unaligned so what we do uh, okay same as we can make the center we have learned before uh, now here we change it to be justify justify means alignment by the all sides justify and now let's see here now it's in the proper form even if I make it to be the minimize my text will become automatically be justified see this paragraph is completely justified now the next thing is uh, hyperlink hyperlink means uh, the connected between the another file another picture or an another HTML page with the HTML page we have the one tag that is a tag for example if I use here uh, the another paragraph see this is the boundary hi go to page 2 click here if I want to make uh, this specific click here should be on uh, the hyperlink I, I write the tag A and here I will close the A tag if I save uh, let's see there will be no change here both are the same page so what I do I should need uh, what is the purpose so the basic of the uh, property is href means where you want to go is equals to here I write uh, two dot html okay now let's see what's happening here I refresh my page see the color is changed with the blue and it's underlined when I click it to let's see there is a no page number 2 of HTML here so it shows there is nothing connected okay this is the second dot HTML so what I do here I write it here second dot HTML now I go to back and click again okay refresh first now see the second dot html same as uh, if I want to change this page uh, again back so I can write here in the next file I should need to be open and made it to be the correct this is the second html uh, 
I write here the same text. A close A go back. You have ever seen in the website it shows the go back. So A H R E F means link that is three dot HTML. I save it here. Okay, and I close that. Okay, let's see. Now the refresh, go back, and again in my page. So it means it is linked with the another HTML. Or if I want to add any picture, uh, if I want to go any picture. So let's see. Here is no picture. So I will copy any picture from another folder let's see here's my picture let's suppose elephant one I'm going to make it the paste now so I write here and click here or again here I write the use tag br okay B. H R E F Elephant dot JPG. You can add any uh, file, even it, it it can be any document file. You you can add or uh, whatever it's open in the um, file. It will be open. Otherwise, it will become the download by default it's trying to be open uh, in the html page for example word excel powerpoint file you cannot open so they it, they will become a download it, it will not open in the text but the pdf and the jpeg it can open i save it uh, here elephant1.jpg and i write some text here Elephant Now I make again refresh see if I click on the elephant you see the JPEG file will be open Now uh, this is uh, our the hyperlink option so in the next tutorial inshallah uh, we will learn some uh, more about html so thanks again bye